Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Kinasi Safira Kresnadi and my name is Sonia Putri Abiyese. We are from SMA Negeri 3 Semarang. In everyday life, we are often injured by being bumped or stretched by sharp objects. This type of wounds then called a cut wound. To help this one, people usually use synthetic medicine, but they have several side effects because they contain chemical and preservatives. Currently, in Indonesia, herbal medicine has been developed from ingredients that are easy to find, plant, and have no side effects. We choose Binahong and Moring leaf as materials because based on Article Asuxi 2012, Binahong leaf contain is alkaloids, flavonoids, terpenoids, and saponins. And based on article Kumar and Ali Ayu 2016, Moring leaf contain is saponins and tannins. Therefore, it is necessary to provide gel made from natural products to rapid the wound healing process at a relatively cheaper price. So, we created the extract of vinyl leaf and moringa leaf as a gel wound healing. Our research method is experimental by analysis quantitative and qualitative with the following procedure. 2 kg of pinahong leaves and moringa leaves are cleaned and macerated with 70% ethanol for 5 days then filtered. The macerate is further macerated with 96% ethanol for 2 days then filtered. The final result of the macerate is evaporated and then dried to become powder. Pinahong leaf extract and moringa leaf extract in powder form is ready to use and stored in a tightly closed container. Secondly, extract formulation. Combine the pinahong leaf extract and moringa leaf extract based on the specified formulation which can be seen on the table. Thirdly, some gel samples are sent to the Chemistry Laboratory of Universitas Negeri Semarang to be analyzed for its phytochemistry content. Then, Laboratory Central Hayati of Universitas Brawijaya to analyze its phytopharmaceuticals and organoleptic. Fourth stage, extract application on mice. Prepare mice aged 2 until 3 months and each mice is injured. Apply gel of pinahong and moringa leaf extract using a cotton bag. Gel is applied regularly twice a day at a distance of 8 hours until the wound heals. The final stage was proximate analysis, total plate count, and organoleptic analysis to determine the gel is safe and rich ingredients to enhance the wound healing process. This is the results of phenol leaf and moringa leaf extract phytochemical analysis. The results of the phytochemical test we perform are that phenol leaf extract positively contains alkaloids, flavonoids, saponins, and tannins. Apart from that, moringa leaf extract positively contains alkaloids, flavonoids, saponins, steroids, and tannins. Phytopharmaceuticals analysis results show that gel made from phenol and moringa leaf extract contains protein, fat, carbohydrate, water, ash, flavonoid, and acetate acid. And this is pinong leaf and moringa leaf extract organoleptic analysis result. For the extract application on mice, we compared control group and treatment group, resulting that mice in group 5 or T4 exhibited the fast one healing rate compared to group 3 or T2 and 4 or T3. This is the result of bleeding time and clotting time test. As we can see, the clotting time test showed that all groups had an average blood clotting time of less than 900 seconds. This indicates that all experimental animals didn't have disorders. Then, we did the normality and homogeneity test. Based on the table above, it can be stated that there is no significant difference between the treatment groups. Based on our research, it can be concluded that first, the combinations of phenol leaf extract and moringa leaf extract can accelerate the healing of cuts in mice. Second, the best combinations of phenol leaf extract and moringa leaf extract and accelerating the healing of cut wounds in mice, namely T4 with a wound healing time of 12 until 14 days. Third, the combinations of pink gel is quite effective to rapid wound healing with formulations of 10% vinyl leaf extract and 5% moringa leaf extract. That's all for our presentation and thank you for your attention. We hope that in future research, the natural ingredients used to make gel can be more variety. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.